Good afternoon, First Baptist Church. Brother Luke here. And uh, today for our weekly devotion, I want to promote our Back to School Bash. This coming Sunday, uh, August 15th, from 5.30 to 7, we're going to have our Back to School Bash here at the church. We're going to have inflatables, yard games, we're going to have snow cone machines. It's going to be an awesome time for our students as they get ready to return back to school, but also for their families. And we want to take this time just to celebrate and to be able to support one another as we enter back in to the school year. Now, for those of you that still have uh, children in school or those of you who have had children, you know that the school year can be very stressful. Uh, it, the things from uh, ball games and rehearsals and recitals and making sure that the kids are picked up and making sure that I have someone to uh, watch my children because I'm now working, I'm back in school and all of these different uh, things come on to these young families and they add stress to their lives. And so one way what we want to do here at First Baptist Church to try to help alleviate some of that stress is first uh, when we start out at 530 we're going to have the blessing of the backpacks. We're encouraging all children, uh, all uh, everyone who is going to school uh, to bring your backpack to school. Uh, we've made some keychains that have our church logo and, and things like that on them and we're going to hand those out. We want to take the time praying for the students, praying for uh, them as they enter in to this school year. But we also want to take time to pray for their families. Uh, we want to pray for the teachers and the mentors that are going to be impacting these children's lives. And so the one way that we're going to do that is we're trying to take, we're trying to pair individuals or couples uh, within the congregation with one of these families that has school-aged children. And when I say school-aged children, that is everyone from preschool all the way to college students. Uh, anyone who's going to be having a child or has a child at home or, or has a child that is still in school, we want them to be a part of this. And so we're going to have individuals volunteer to adopt a family. And what that means is that you are simply agreeing and that you want to pray for this family. Uh, you're going to find out their prayer requests. Find out uh, you know, when they have ball games and things. Not saying that you have to go to those ball games or you have to have any more responsibility. We just want you to say, I am willing to pray for this family as they navigate this school year. And so we're going to have cards for, uh, cards with family members and the, and the family's information on them. And we'll be able to hand those out and that way. You can pray for your family each and every week. So, this back to school bash is not just for children, it's not just for parents with families, it is for all ages. The inflatables and things we have are, and the games that we have, anyone can do, whether you are in preschool or you are our oldest member in the church. We want the church to come together and really uh, just enjoy and celebrate being a family and being united together. If you don't want to jump on the inflatables, bring your lawn chair out and sit among us and just enjoy watching the kids play and interacting with their family members. But most importantly, come and pray with us and continue to pray with us as the students, their parents, our school systems navigate this school year and pray that the Lord will continue to guide and direct our young people and their families as they handle these stressful times. A, verse that I, a couple verses that I want to encourage you with today is Philippians chapter 4, verses 6 and 7. And it says, Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. And the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. For those of you that are experiencing this school year, you know that it might, is going to be stressful. There are going to be things in this year that are going to come up that are going to put stress on you and your family. We've got to take those things, take those petitions to God. And for those of you that may not be having children or don't have children in the house or you're not experiencing this school year, one way that you can help can be involved is to pray for these young families to take these petitions to God and plead to Him and to ask for His wisdom and His guidance in their lives. But also we are to thank God 
for who he is, thanking God for the ability to go to school, thanking God for the teachers and the mentors that are influence our students, thanking God for just the blessings and things that he has given us. And when we do those things, his peace and his understanding and his knowledge are going to come over us, going to come over these young families, and is going to be able to guide them through this school year. I hope to see everyone at the church at 5.30 on Sunday, August 15th. Please uh, share this video. Tell your friends. We are excited for what God is doing here in Danville. And I cannot wait to see what he's going to do uh, this school year and, uh, and beyond. Have a wonderful day. We'll see you soon.